Hey guys, Kai Wai here. Welcome to WPF uh, da, 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 season off season. Wow, off season four, week two. Ooh, coach of the Las Vegas Lotties, that is me. I've misplaced every single click so far. That's wonderful. Uh, this week I am up against Muffin Knight of the Pittsburgh Print Plup, who is uh, Grass Steel, which is interesting. It's pretty weak to fire. However, he has Cortana, Copalion, Rotomo, Alolan Sandslash, Corviknight, Brazong, Livani, Steelix, Melmetal, Appleton, and Mega Sceptile. So he has strong things, but I think collectively it just kind of takes some ice and some fire coverage and they all generally go down. Uh, that's what pretty much everything is here. It either has, like, a lot of defense, or... You know, there's two things with a lot of defense, and then other things with a lot of offensive prowess, just to be like, hey, here's some ice beams and flamethrowers, because that just kind of destroys this team. Obviously, he has heatproof on Bronzong if he needs it, or levitate. I assume that he doesn't bring levitate. Probably heatproof if he does bring Bronzong at all. And then, uh... Appleton with Thick Fat actually does technically resist fire. However, I think anything with fire here also has, uh, other than her galaxy, has access to ice. And then September, the Duraludon here just wants to just eat people alive, I guess. It's a cool set. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just going to hop right into this. That's get Get out of here with your volume. All right, who'd you bring? Cortana, Lolan Sandslash, Cobalion, Corviknight, Melmetal, and... Steelix. So, this is wallable. Um, with my Duraludon here. I actually don't have any of the special attackers that I worried about. Appleton included. So, I don't think he does anything to me if I just sit here and uh, spam freaking Duraludon. I mean, yeah. I don't really like if I do that. You really don't like that. Well, that's that's interesting. Look at link here and <sighs> done. Cool. And now we have a bot in our game. Yay! Battle joint. So, does Duraludon just come in and click a button to set up? <laughs> Problem is that the only way it gets healing is leftovers, meaning that I, I could get run down very very quickly Altaria can get run down very very quickly although it has Roost but Cotton Guard is like substitute nah. so acid armor or something I'm running on Gudra here it's 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 a set for sure uh, shout out to Cynthia for helping me with the sets here I've been procrastinating on things this match included which is why it's a little late on being uploaded and all that jazz so Grandpa with and actually, pretty high special attack stat. Actually, it might be the highest special attack stat here just because it has specs. And specs hurts. Alright, I think I'm just gonna. <sighs> Do I wanna just lead Duraludon and click Body Press? Not uh, Body Press, Iron Defense? It's like, what does he lead with at this point? Uh, I know I need to keep track of Ice Shard and Icicle Crash on this guy for like every single dragon I have here. Ugh. What, what would you lead with? I don't know. Let's just find out. Let's find out. Steelix. That's really nice. Roll XXX. Thank you for that beautiful name. Alright, Steelix. This is probably what he wanted. I assume it's an offensive stealth rocker. That just makes sense to me. Um, you die. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let's not have plus six defense here. Yeah, there we go. Earthquake hurts. Um, I don't think I actually want to just take an earthquake immediately right now. That sounds really dumb. Ugh, Steelix. You could curse, you could earthquake. There's a lot you could do here. I think I'm gonna click body press. Cause like, ugh. If he predicts a switch. I'm not body press, god. No, not body press, iron defense. I'm getting the two mixed up. Cause the thing is, if you click earthquake, if you click curse or stealth rock, if you click curse or stealth rock, Iron Defense was a, a good play for us, I think. And then... Uh, I don't know. 
because as, as Steelix could run my whole team right now, but I, I don't think it will. I just want to know what are my options to kill this thing if need be. Dragalges, HP fire doesn't too much. Gudras, flamethrower, dust is a decent bit. What is Drampa able to do? Drampa just obliterates this thing. It dies to one flamethrower. Easy peasy. Whatever. Um, if you do earthquake, it unfortunately doesn't put me. I forget what berserk range is. It'd be funny if I just had berserk range. I'm like, alright, you're all dying. <laughs> Ugh, I just have to be careful with Drampaw, because Drampaw is kind of like my big nuke clicker. I'm just going to click Iron Defense, see what happens. Alright. South Rock. There we go. I figured that'd be pretty free. Not, not on Drampaw. On Duraludon, your defense is now plus two. Earthquake is doing quite a bit less, and we're faster, for sure. I'm going to just click Iron Defense again, right? Okay, you use Roar. That's fun as hell. Hi, I'm going to click Flamethrower now. Have a good day. <laughs> this is this is fun. Why, why do I have OHP? I was like, what was that yellow? I don't think I've ever noticed that before. So Roar, Roar is interesting. That is not something I expected you to run. Um, nothing here wants to take a Flamethrower at all. So, I mean, have fun with that. I don't, I don't mind this at all, at all. There's nothing to do here. Cause it doesn't, he doesn't, he didn't bring a single fire resist. Literally everything here doesn't want to take damage of fire. And if this is your only, like, roar here, then like, I get to set up more iron defenses because I have 100% on Duraludon still, so Duraludon is super safe still. Not gonna be able to see sub on any of the, the sub acid armor set on Kudra here, I don't think, because I just. I'm too low right now. Yeah, okay. See ya. We can't get 6 0 yet. That's something. 54%. I don't even know what you, what you send out at this point. Uh, probably something faster than me. If you send out a little in Sand Slash, you can get off a... Uh, I don't think... Uh, sand Slash, a little, uh, like... Let's call it offensive support, sure. I mean, like... Shove a berry? I don't even know. We can just put Choice Scarf on that. Is that a thing that someone will ever do? I mean, like... It's fast. It doesn't have to actually necessarily... Like... So beast boosting here, that's the thing I actually need to be afraid of. So Cortana wants to take lives. Let's just let's assume it's banded, because I don't think you wouldn't run it banded. You see, Smart Strike uh hurts a lot. But if you if you band yourself into that, do you want to be banded in that? Because can a my fastest member here, 256, 108, 256, it's, it's you, and we're, we're definitely outspent in every single degree. Can a hidden power fire kill you? It, it should. Oh, it absolutely does. Oh, that's disgusting. <laughs> Just click flames over, right? Alright. So that boosts your attack. But does Mark Strike kill me at this point? I, I want to assume you're man. Oh, wait, you're plus one now. I should have looked at that real quick. That's no bueno. That's no bueno. That's no bueno. Why'd I do that? Wait, let me think about this. That's no bueno. Ugh. I might have just thrown this game because Cortana's busted. Ugh. That's no bueno. Much less. Uh. If I switch into Duraludon, I should have just went Duraludon. The King Power Fire. I don't. 
I don't know why it took you so long to make a decision, because you just click Smart Strike, right? You just, there's no reason you don't click Smart Strike here. I see zero reason at all to not do that. Because you're definitely, like, you've, you're more than likely, I mean, if it's not, not max speed, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, it didn't kill. Oh god. Thank you. You're not banded, apparently. You actually might have been Scarf. Hi. Hi, Melmetal. You are a potential threat. However, does an adamant max attack attack kill me? The thing is, you're not boosting it, at the very least, off of just killing me, so that's, that's fun. Choice band, double iron bash. That's the only thing I ever calc for because it kills. Oh my god, it obliterates me. That's so sad. Go for the chip or to go for the defog? Let's see here. I kind of like the defog. I'm not gonna lie. This defog is extremely helpful in here. Mr. Mega Altaria. You can finish it off though. Do this 42% plus. Oh, it, <sighs> there's a chance that HP fire into Altaria Flamethrower kills. Uh, do, you, do you think he's calcing to outspeed a Trampa? You like speed, speed creep me? That'd be whack. That'd be insanely crazy. I just gotta click it out of fire. Oh my god. So, you're specially defensive. Hi. That's fun. So you have Ice Punch. That's good to know. Hi. How does Duraludon feel about all of this? Uh, I get up my defense first, that's for sure. And I care a whole lot less. I care a, a significant bit less. Um, I could T-wave you as well. So I don't, at plus two, you don't do much, and then I can start doing things that are fun. Oh, it's, it's a close game right now, especially because I know that you're, you're max spadef in some capacity, I, I believe. Because, I mean, let's, let's, let's back up. I need I keep getting ahead of myself here, and I'm not happy about that. So let's, let's say you're Assault Vest. That's what I'll bet. Assault Vest? Yeah, see, there we go. That number makes a lot more sense. 21%. Although, uh, that would be, like, plus some death minus some attack, possibly, honestly. Uh, plus some death minus some attack. Plus some death minus some attack. Careful. I mean, your assault vest, careful, max, but def, max HP, possibly. That's how I do 21% with hidden power fire. There was my calcs. That's just how it how it goes down. So that's very helpful. Because then I feel like I have a lot less to worry about here, especially when we go into to, into the Duraludon. That's a lot less damage you're outputting, especially if I hit the plus two defense. You're doing literally nothing to me. He gets Earthquake, I guess I'll calc that. Earthquake. That's still nothing, though. Is 
we outspeed Melmetal with pretty much everything here. And, like, he doesn't take much damage from flamethrowers by any degree. Where our, our best damage output at this point is flamethrower from Drampa, which does 50%. But then we probably die to, like, a double iron bash. Everything here is also part steel, so I don't really feel inclined to just start setting up stealth rocks. It's like 12% on two mons, and then like barely any on Cobalion. I'm not sure what to do because I'm really just waiting right now on him to select a move here. I can see why you would be concerned considering that he has only physical attackers remaining and, you know, at this point I feel like his attempt would be like to switch into the freaking, what, the Corviknight and maybe spam bulk up if you have it. Iron defense into body press does work here. I, I don't know. If I get to plus six, I don't think anything lives. Which is ridiculous to get to. Okay, let's see. Uh, plus two. At most with Earthquake, it does 22%. And that would take me down to... I'm just using rough numbers here. 88. And the next turn, it does 15. Which takes me down to... for some reason, uh, 72, right? Yeah, 72, and then at plus 6, he does 11, which then is 61%, and then I Oko with Body Press uh, from that point, and then I don't know what here actually doesn't just die to Body Press. Um, it, because Sand Slash, a little in Sand Slash, absolutely die. He does get damage in, more than likely, like an Icicle Crash or something, but what what does plus six Icicle Crash do? Even plus six, plus six Icicle Crash, what, oh, well, I mean, Icicle Crash into plus six defense to Aladon, I don't think does much, especially when we're running just full on defense, just, yeah, he, I, this turn is taking an awful long time, I know I took a while got him in a bit of a corner, <laughs> but I don't, I don't know what to keep saying. Something uh, is obviously wrong here. Because it's saying that Thunder Wave would do 15%. And I'm. <laughs> I'm gonna be real honest. I don't think Thunder Wave's gonna do 15%. Does this work? At least break everything. I did. Yeah, okay, you can see it. Yeah, so look at that. Thunder Wave does 15%, guys. <laughs> Stealth Rock does 18%. Iron Defense does 16%. What the fuck? Fuck. Oh my god, were we waiting on me? I think we were waiting on me. Yeah. 
Hi, buddy. Is this the chip you needed? Did you calc chip that you needed on me? <laughs> See ya! Um... Uh, so your ability is justified. I need to remember, I think justified just increases your attack if hit by a... Uh, uh, dark move. So I didn't actually quite get to calcing. I just make sure it's screen showing. So I'm dumb as hell. Um, let's see here. Duraludon. Into a Cobalion. Let's say it's Sword Stance, sure. At plus four. I just click button press, right? Bro, he missed the Focus Blast. Yo. That. Oof. GG. That, that was huge for him. A body press doesn't actually KO here. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> okay. Okay. Bro, September with the kills, though. Best one on the Duraludon. Uh... I, I highly doubt. I mean, I, I can calc it here. Say so your your max special attack and your modest with like choice specs does focus miss kill. It does absolutely does. But that might not have been what he is. Um. That's crazy. Wow. Okay, well, GG. I thought I was going to lose on the Cortana, but then we got crazy hacks on the focus miss. I mean, it's 30% miss. So, whatever. But, it it's something for sure. But... Last. Okay. So that's that's two wins in a row. That's a 4 0. We, we were kind of like the worst of all the winners because we only got a 3 0 last time, but. Uh, especially because someone got a 6 0. Now, now we have a, a solid 4 0 on top of our 3 0, so we're, we're doing good. I am happy with the results here, so. Muffin. Nice. GG's the opponent, like I said. I think the hacks mattered to a point where we... It depends on what his set was. If he was all modest, max attack and all that, then I guess we lose that in particular. But it also have to be choice, which means that I just send in uh, Altaria, right? And I just spam flamethrowers. Hmm. I don't know. Alright, so next week we are fighting. Actually, I don't know who we're fighting next week. Let's find out. Wait, I have to look at the schedule thing. Yeah, that would be making sense. Where is it? Cool, we fight. Atlan Mail, who I think must be a replacement coach, because that name is not familiar to me. I don't think I drafted with an Atlan Mail. They're not even... Oh, they're not. Oh, they're, oh, they're Ice Normal, Oakland Rose Raiders. What's with all this this fighting and fire week stuff? Are we do we bring body press again? That maybe he has nothing to resist it, right? Yikes! That's a hard yikes. All right, well we'll see uh, next week, which was probably this uploaded the same week as this week because I'm a procrastinator. Who knows? I'm just really behind. See ya. Oh, voice crack.